Yes, people. Um, hello. Um, I just wanted to say this has been a long time coming. This is today's tutorial on how to open a fresh green coconut. So first, if you don't know, um, this is a young green coconut. You know, so the brown hairy ones you see in fairs and stuff, this is how it starts. This is how it grows from the tree naturally. So what there is inside here is a little shell. The brown hairy shell is inside this green casing, basically. And um, what you want to do when you're trying to attempt to open a coconut is get through this outer layer into the nut underneath to reveal or get to the nice hydrating water inside. Now, like the benefits of fresh coconut water, you can go on forever, but um, one of the, the greatest things about the coconut is it has the same electrolytic balance as our blood, so the same level of potassium, magnesium, calcium, iron, um, it's got a high level of vitamin C, it's an all around superfood. Now, I'm not going to go into too much de detail about the health benefits, we can leave that to another time, but what I am going to do is I'm going to show you exactly how to open one of these fresh green coconuts using three tools. I basically got a small little kitchen knife, a screwdriver and a bread knife. And I've also got my machete that I use, but I wouldn't advise anybody, especially inexperienced people, to use a machete because it is dangerous. Um, and I also advise that any of these other utensils that you use, be as careful as possible, be as mindful as possible. Just realize that you've got a sharp object in your hand. Now the first, the first means uh, the little knife and the screwdriver are basically the same kind of process, essentially. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna start from this part of the coconut, which is where the branch would have attached to the coconut. And when you pop, what you're gonna do basically is, you can do this with a knife or a screwdriver. You're gonna literally pop off the little hat. So what's inside here, it's all soft because actually this is where the water has been pumped in. And what you can actually do, either with a small knife or a screwdriver, is literally... See, I'm straight in already. Again, you can do this with a screwdriver as well. See? In already. Make sure you clean the screwdriver. And then boom. Now this might take a little bit long, but you put it in a little bowl or a jug, leave it to one side and the water will drain out of the coconut into the jug. Now, the second basic way is gonna be using a bread knife. So this ain't too sharp, it's serrated. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this with um, a chopping board. We're gonna start on the opposite side of the coconut which is closer to the top of the nut, the shell, the, 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 the hard shell inside. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna shave around the top of it until you get to the nut inside. And what you can do also is flatten off the bottom of the coconut so that you can have a, a, a flat surface that you, to rest it on the chopping board, to tap it with the bread knife afterwards to open it, crack the shell um, within to uh, expose the water and also with this method if you can get a wide enough hole at the top you can get to the fresh coconut jelly which is a great source of uh, healthy fats and good support for your immune system. The final way um, is basically with this is actually a staking knife so it's not a machete you can have a lot bigger knives I've seen people from all over the world use these massive knives and this again you're starting at the top it. Yeah, so this will be the top of the coconut. Um, again, because it's closer to the nut, so you have to go through less of the husk to get to the hard shell inside. And all you're gonna do, basically, you can do two ways. So you can shave it, again, like how I did with the bread knife, which is like this. Or, alternatively, you can do it in three chops if you want, or one chop, or two chops. But I'm not gonna go too much into that. This is just to show you uh, how to do it with, with a lot bigger knife but you don't need to obviously endanger your hand. This is more for people that are skilled who've had experience dealing with um, coconuts in this way. So this is the free chop.
and we can feast straight away. Yeah, so if you're lucky enough to gain access to these coconuts, um, there's lots of wholesalers around. If you're based in London, you can find them. Uh, alternatively, DM us if you want a box or a half box of coconuts and I'll let you know the prices. But again, there are people vending them all around London, South London, North London, East London. If you're outside of this and you can source them, amazing. Hopefully this um, video will benefit you. And yeah, man, um, let me know if you have any further questions. I wanted to keep it as short and sweet as possible and as easy as possible. And maybe what we'll do is we'll, in the next video, we'll go into more detail about how to get to the nice jelly inside. So feel free to ask me, let me know what you want to see. And I'll see you very soon. Awesome.